it's Kay. Welcome back to Hub Meet Home. And today, you're going to see the cutest organizing video you've ever seen. Do you ever wonder what to do with the tiny little things in your house? The itty bitty little tiny things? Well, today, we're gonna to talk about how to keep the tiny things from getting it to be a big problem. It seems like tiny things are such a pain in the butt to store, especially because they just, they go everywhere. They're like little, little ants. They just kind of just, they scatter. And it's really hard to, to get organizing solutions for these things because they're just so small. Today I'm gonna to share with you some great ideas for storing tiny things to inspire you to get the little things under control. Are you ready? Let's go, so cute. Now for me, as in terms of organizing little solutions, 2017 is pretty much the year of the trinket tray. I've used it here um, to store my little spare house keys and my little alarm just in case anything happens. Um, and I have a little teacup here. This is actually a very small tiny teacup that I got from a store where you can actually buy like tea items. Um, but I, it's just small enough to fit my little Pokemon Go Plus because I use it to uh, play Pokemon Go. And yes, still play, still fun. And speaking of keys, I just wanna talk about the uh, Umbra Magnetar one more time. It's great for your keys because you just grab them and then you just stick them right back up there because science and magnets. Most people use trinket trays for jewelry and I do too. This is my little turtle trinket tray. He happens to be named Sheldon. He's very cute. Anyway, sometimes before bed, I forget to take my earrings off. So I just take them off and I put them in this little tray because it's right beside my bed and they never get lost because Sheldon is watching them. And I have a trinket tray in the bathroom too to take off my earrings before I take a shower just because I don't want them to get wet for some reason. I don't know. And the uh, tray lives right in my cabinet with the rest of my toiletries so things never get lost. Speaking of teacups doing a great thing for organization, this is a little mini latte bowl and I have used it to store my little perfume samples. You know, the kind you get when you go to Sephora and they just give you a sample. I have amassed a few of these and I like to keep them in my little latte bowl to remind me to use them every now and again, just in case I wanna, you know, mix it up. And next to my latte bowl, lives my little Eiffel Tower ring holder. Is this not the cutest thing you've ever seen? Just in case you have a lot of rings, you don't want them to wander away and get lost. You could totally use a trinket tray for this, but I think this Eiffel Tower is super cute. And speaking of more jewelry storage, I think it is totally a great idea to hang your earrings I have not lost a single earring or had a single necklace tangle since I started using this method and I believe, I believe very strongly in it. Hang your earrings. Now I am a self-admitted makeup junkie, but I love this little makeup brush separator and I don't know if it's intended for that, but that's what I'm using it for. This is the Tubo by Ombra. It is the most ingenious little organizer. I have a blending brushes in one, shader brushes in another, eyebrow brushes in one. It helps me keep so organized when I am getting all pretty. I honestly think bobby pins just run away. I think they have little feet and they run away. Anyway, this little solution has helped me keep more of them. This is actually a little container that has a magnetized opening and it came with some uh, paper clips in it, but I moved the paper clips somewhere else and put bobby pins in there because they're way more of a problem and this has been so awesome. And uh, I think you guys know how I feel about taking things out of the packaging. I'm a big fan of it and batteries are no exception. I keep all the batteries together in this little divided box and it makes finding a battery and grabbing one so much easier. 
Now rubber bands are another thing that tends to just run free and go crazy, um, but we have corralled them all in this lockup container and they have never been more contained and more tame. I also wanted to mention really quickly that those little clips you use to tie like bags together, like those chip bags, they have their own dedicated drawer organizer so they never get lost because these little things can disappear as well. Now I'm just a little bit accident prone so I need access to band-aids really quickly and easily. So I've got this little drawer unit just dedicated to band-aids and Neosporin and it has been really helpful when, you know, kitchen things happen. I love this next solution for hair elastics. Now hair elastics are another thing that just tend to go everywhere, but this is actually a command hook that's used to hold wires, but I repurposed it to hold hair elastics. Now all you have to do is like take that little thing down, grab a hair elastic, and then put it back. The hair elastics don't even go all over the place when you have the hook unattached. It's my favorite. I know you guys have heard this before, but man, those old Bath & Body Works candles, like containers, they make great containers. So all you have to do is clean out the wax from the container. There's lots of videos on YouTube that show you how to do that. And I have been using it to store Q-tips and it had such a cute top. Free container! So, was that cute? Did you guys get any ideas how to store like little things in your uh, apartment in your house let me know down in the comment below what are the m like most messy and like hard to store little things in your house leave me a comment down below I want to know and we can uh, solve this problem together if you're not part of the hub neat home family please subscribe I'd love to have you here if you want to not miss a video just go ahead and press that bell so you get a notification every time I upload Monday Wednesday and Friday I hope you guys are having a great day and I will see you later thanks for watching bye